friends welcome back to our channel learn with gig in this video i will discuss with you one power query question which was recently asked in the power bay interview one of the subscribers of this channel provided me this question so i am creating a video on this so that you all can be aware about it and if it is asked in your interviews you can answer it too easily so let's start the video and before that if you are new to the channel then do subscribe it and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the coming useful videos and also you can follow me on instagram learn with gigs you will find short videos on data analytics domain as well as job related updates regularly all right so here is the question provided by that subscriber so you can see he has mentioned there is two columns one is containing john mike alice which means the name of the person and in another column the subjects taken by those people are shown for example john has taken english physics maths mike has taken physics maths alice has taken english so what is the question convert above table into below table in power bi and the result should be like this where you have three entries of john two entries of mike and one entry of alice so it is asked in one of the interview and he asked to create a video on this now let's see how we can do it in power bi so i have loaded the same data that is given by the interviewer so i have a name column i have a subject column with those entries now if you are watching this video think about the solution first and then see the answer okay how you would have done it if the question was asked directly to you so first of all the first step that i will make here is i will split this column subject to multiple columns otherwise i won't be able to extract the individual values of english physics and maths so first step is splitting this column so what i will do i will click on this column and split column and i will choose by delimiter so the delimiter here is comma only so i will keep it as it is each occurrence of the delimiter yes then now now i will click on okay so this is the result where you are getting english physics maths in a single row now physics and maths and then in the last english for ls now you think what should be the next step how we can take out the solution so whenever you are doing these kind of problems you have to know about the concept of pivoting and unpivoting so think about what can be useful here unpivoting what is unpivoting unpivoting is basically converting columns into rows so my task is to make these entries into rows now let's see if i am able to do it with the help of unpivoting again the result will not be final but let's see what happens so i will select these three columns that is subject 1 subject 2 subject 3 right click and click on unpivot columns once i will click on unpivot columns let's see what will happen now you can see i have got three columns name attribute and value i got those entries of english physics maths in in a separate row but i have got another column which is containing those those headers also so what i will do i will just click on this column and remove once i will remove now you can see we have got the desired result do hit the like button if you like the content and share this video to all your friends and colleagues whoever are looking out for jobs in the market